Welcome to the Pilates Show, where we explore Pilates tips and techniques to help deepen the skill level of the movement educator while having fun. Hi, I'm Jen Gianni, and today we're going to be talking about opening the um, SCM that runs on a diagonal from our mastoid process all the way down to our collarbone and our sternum. And so it connects back to front. So mm, any tightnesses in this area can affect skull and neck, and it can affect the chest, breastbone, collarbone, front of the neck, right? So it's really good to keep this, this area uh, fluid and released. So the best way to do this is supine again. So I'm gonna go onto my back on the pillow. Legs should be relaxed. And then what you wanna do here is take your thumb and your first finger and you wanna trace down from your um, occiput, your mastoid process, down the side of your neck. And you'll feel when this muscle gets a little bit meatier, right? And you wanna grab hold of that muscle. Um, you want it to be firm, yet gentle, right? You don't wanna squeeze the death out of it, but you wanna hold on to it. And then from here, you can just relax into the back of the body and breathe. It also, once you get used to this, if you turn your head away from your hand and then gently come back, and that's gonna to start to open that up a bit more. So you turn your head away from your hand, letting go of your jaw and your teeth, and then gently releasing back. And once more, so you can do this three or four times, release back, and then you can move your hands down a little bit um, and do the same exact thing. And then of course, like we do with all of the release work, you want them to do one side and just really notice the difference. And, if, and again, just from doing that little bit, enormous difference, and I even feel the difference not only in my neck, but I feel a more open chest and my shoulder blade is actually releasing to the floor. So this side of my upper back feels totally different just because of that release of my SEM. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below, on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.